First, I must say, I'm near qualified to prove the theory of evolution, nor I think that the question of proving it is relevant. Science isn't in the business of proving things. Rather, science judges the merits of competing models in terms of their simplicity, clarity, comprehensiveness, and fit to the data. Scientific theories are not proven. A hypothesis is formulated to explain observed phenomena. A good hypothesis must first explain the observed data. Second, explain future observed data. Third, be compatible with observations in other fields. And fourth, be falsifiable. This last item is what allows us to trust a hypothesis, at least temporarily. Unfalsifiable claims can be true or false, but there's no way to know if they are false, so it is irrelevant to research them. So, if new observations are being made, attempting to both verify the prediction, but mainly to attempt to falsify the hypothesis, then the hypothesis stands and is considered a theory. If new observations are inconsistent, the hypothesis should be corrected or replaced by a hypothesis that better explains both the new observations and the original ones. So it is pointless to prove the theory of evolution. What can be done is attempting to falsify the hypothesis, for example, by finding or pointing observed data that cannot be explained. I am a layman. I cannot provide you with extensive evidence for the theory, and particularly, I cannot answer a specific data that challenges the theory. I have seen some of those challenges observations that attempt to falsify the theory, as well as plausible explanations within the theory. I have also seen observations that attempt to falsify special creation and plausible explanations within the model. Well, actually, within the model of a special creation, every attempt to falsify it can be answered by the will of the creator. The devil wants to deceive us. Now, with two or more competing models, both equally good at explaining observable data, and near falsified, there are two criteria that I use, the Ockham razor and the falsifiability factor. Unfalsifiable claims and models cannot be trusted, so that's why I don't trust creation, either a special creation or general creation, as the special creation has too many more claims in the model that I have more reasons not to believe it. And creation has two additional assumptions over naturalistic explanations, that creating God existed, and that the creating God willed the creation. If you want evidence for the theory of evolution, there are plenty of sites. If you want to challenge a particular piece of evidence, you can ask in relevant forums. If you are still unconvinced, publish your findings and your objections. You have a more viable, falsifiable model to propose? Do it! Or you can ask lay YouTubers to do the homework for you after having made your mind that no proof will convince you.